Hi everyone, this is for Kyocera Task Alpha 2554CI. This applies to all the 4 series models including the black and white. How do we enter the administrator mode? And the reason why we want to go into administrator mode is when you're setting it, the machine up on a network, let's say we go up to this three dots, system menu, and then network settings. If you want to change wired network settings, it'll ask you for a username and a password. The default username and password is capital A, lowercase d, M I N, and the serial number of your device. So the way you can find your serial number is you go to the top front control panel where the toner cartridges are. You're going to see on the right side, you're going to see a serial number. That string of numbers and, and capital letters is your password for your administrator login. So go ahead and type that in, whatever your device's serial number is, hit login, that should get you into the administrator mode. Um, if that doesn't work, you might want to try the old Kyocera password. Sometimes when this is set up from the beginning, somebody might change it to the old one, which is the same for the username, admin with a capital A, and the password being admin, same thing with a capital A, D, M, I, N. Try that one as well. Hit login. Now, if that doesn't work, then you can actually log in with you can actually log in with your device's first two digit first two digits which is mine is happens to be 25 so if you have a 4554 or a 5054 or even like a 4004 it'll be your first two digits of the 4004 which is 40 so mine happens to be 25 and the last two digits, you you will replace it with zeros. So mine will be two five zero zero. So that will be both the login username two five zero zero, and the password will be two five zero zero. So twenty five hundred twenty five hundred. Again, if yours is a another model, it'll be the first two digits digits plus the two zeros. So you hit that, go login. And I got in. Now I can change my network settings, put in all the, my network settings here, and log in. Now if you have still problems trying to log in, because that can be changed as well, there is a way to reset the administrator's password. And that is done in another, in another video. Go ahead and post a comment letting me know if you need that, need that posted.